I buy and sell horses as part of the, my living. Kevin LaFond may buy and sell horses, but according to the BCSPCA, the animals located on his farm in Grand Forks were emaciated and improperly cared for, which is why 10 were seized. Two of those were allegedly in such poor shape they had to be euthanized. The horses that we seized were all below body condition score of, of two, which would mean emaciated, which would be emaciated. So, um, so thin to emaciated, or emaciated to thin, uh, and just no access to shelter. And that was the real concern. Neighbors say there were up to 70 horses on the property, but when the BCSPCA arrived to investigate, most of those animals were gone. Know for sure how many animals were there initially. Um, it looks like some of the animals probably were moved. We are continuing to investigate. Lafond claims the animals came to his farm in poor condition and he was to rehabilitate them, maintaining he did nothing wrong. The horses in question were we were looking after with supervision of the local vets. We've had two vet people involved in giving us. Uh, instructions and how to look after these questionable horses. Residents in the area are also concerned that LaFont sells his horses for meat, which he says sometimes does happen. Uh, horses that are dangerous rear over, go over backwards on people or when you're, you know, horses that you're riding along with and all of a sudden just bust out into a buck. I deem those as dangerous horses and I wouldn't want anybody to get hurt or killed with them, so yes. The horses that were seized by the BCSPCA under the Prevention of Cruelty to Animal Act are being cared for in a facility that the society is keeping a secret. For Castanet News, I'm Jen Zielinski.